Welcome to Engineering Update. I'm Casey Panetta, Managing Editor for ECN. In this week's episode, Making the Impossible Material Possible, NASA's newest plan for 3D printing, and BMW's electric car. An accidental lab oversight resulted in the creation of a material researchers thought was impossible to produce. Upsolite is a non-toxic magnesium carbonate capable of absorbing a lot of moisture at low humidities thanks to a very porous surface area. And we mean very porous. Each gram of the material has 26 trillion nanopores. This particular form of magnesium carbonate doesn't occur naturally, and until now, researchers were unable to create it in a lab environment. However, after a small change to the process and an accidental weekend stay in a reaction chamber, researchers at the Uppsala University realized they had done the impossible. A year later, they had refined the process to create Upslide. The material, which is capable of absorbing 20 times more moisture than silicon, could be a game changer for moisture control in environments where electronics and other water sensitive technology is created, stored, or shipped. Is there no end to the magical and infinite uses for 3D printers? NASA doesn't think so. The agency is planning on putting a printer on the International Space Station as soon as 2014. NASA has been a big supporter of 3D printers in general, funding projects like 3D printed pizza for astronauts and a 3D printed rocket injector. The printer, designed by Made in Space, will be about the size of a shoebox and is specially designed to deal with the microgravitational conditions of space and the ISS environment. It's fully enclosed in metal with a glass window so astronauts can see what's being printed. The plan is to use the printer to print spare parts like clips and buckles, as well as replacement tools. The trip will also be a test of how microgravity will affect the technology. Though the printer has been successfully operated across three suborbital flights, it has one more flight to get through before the big launch. Luxury car brand BMW joins the world of electric cars with their new $42,000 electric hatchback called the i3. The i3 is the brand's first all-electric car and has an 80 to 100 mile range with an eco option that could increase those numbers by 12%. If that's not enough for you, you can choose to equip your car with a 34 horsepower, 650 cc, two-cylinder engine to be used as a backup power supply. That's called the range extender. The standard i3 engine provides 125 kilowatts, 170 horsepower with a torque of 250 newton meters. It can accelerate from 0 to 60 in 4 seconds and features low energy options for braking, environmental control, and lighting. That wraps up this week's report. Be sure to join the conversation on Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn. I'm Casey Panetta, and this has been your Engineering Update. Gotcha. But why?